<coughs> what we're going to do is remove <coughs> we're going to do is remove that cracked screen there see that cracked screen first things first you just take get a knife I use a knife and um, just run it around here let's have a look See? Bring it around. Get in there. That sounds like it popped off easy that time. Next thing you do, you've already taken the screws out using the screwdriver. Or you can use a sharp knife to take the screwdrivers off. What you do next is remove the. Use your fingernail to lift up these. Just use your nail to lift them off. That's to the battery, that's to the screen. Okay, I don't know if you've seen that. That's to the screen, that's to the battery. There's the battery there. Next thing we're going to do, we'll use a knife. The screen's not too bad now. The glue is around these parts here, the black part. Wherever the black part is, that's where the glue is. Let's hope you can see that. That's the glue, okay. I'm going to run the knife eventually along there, along there, along there. Now inside, underneath the cracked screen is an LCD screen on the glass. The LCD screen is a bit recessed, so if you run the knife along here, you won't hit it because it's recessed. So the best way is to run the knife along here, under like that, on a tilt or flat, okay? What I'm going to do first is just see whether I can do it without heating it up. If I can do it without heating up, it'll be good. Now, as you can see, it's going to have to be heated up. Now this screen, the glass, the glass part is stuck onto a piece of plastic, okay? So if you remove the glass, like I'm doing here, what I might do is just give it a bit of a heat. What you can do, you can use this special tool, heat, heat gun that I've got off Ali Bar to heat it up. Now, I'll heat it up like just a long hair where I'm doing it. <coughs> Two ways to do this, you can take the glass off. This glass is stuck on to a piece of plastic, a thin layer of plastic. So if you take the glass off, you're taking the glass off the plastic, which is glued on. This glass is glued onto a piece of plastic, and the plastic just sits on top of the LCD. So there's two layers, the glass and the plastic. Okay? So what you want to do, ideally, is get below the plastic. That's what I'm going to try and do get below the plastic. I'm using, you can use a hairdryer, I, have, I did use a hairdryer on one of them, but I just kept cutting out after a minute or two minutes. I'm using a special heat gun, you can buy cheaply online, it's set to 140 at the moment, roughly. Well, let's see how we go. Just find a, you're not wrecking the phone in any way, so that's better now, see how it's coming off easily now. Now I'm under the glass by the looks of it. Because you can see the knife. Let's go down here. There we are. It's come off very easy. See how easy that's coming off? Look. Once it's heated, it just comes off so easy. As you can see. Anyway, what I'm going to do is just lift this up here. Might be able to show you something here. Underneath here. Doesn't matter if I break break this off. That's it. Underneath here is the L C D screen hopefully. I think we can Alright, so what we're gonna do is we wanna try and get under the plastic, the plastic layer which is there and just run it down there. Now we're getting the glass again, as you can see, we're getting the glass. Anyway, I'll just keep going along here, it doesn't matter. 
There's nothing, you can't wreck anything. Okay, I'll hit this up again. Yeah. Very easy job, see? Heat this up. The glue's only glued along the black part. This cracked screen is not so bad. It's a pretty easy one to do, so I'm heating it up. Right, let's see how we go. Stuff I want this one, isn't it? Just use a bit of the knife. Oops, don't want to go in too far. See how I'm keeping it on an angle? Downward angle. To the top here. See, see. It's more glue on here, that's why it's hard to come off. glue that's under here, it melts pretty easy, it's black like silicon. Pretty easy. Glue it just softens very easy. See? Actually, hmm. if I look here, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. There's the plastic there. See, look, see the plastic there. I'm going to try and get under there, under the plastic. See, look, see the plastic. Try and get under the plastic. Out of the plastic, it'll come, which I have now. I think I'm still under the plastic. I'm under the plastic all the time. Hmm. Doesn't look like it, anyway. up again I think. Yeah it's coming off easy. See you can see the LCD screen, see there? See the LCD screen in there? This is coming off very easy now. Top now. See how easy it comes off when you head it up? Rip it off, you're not going to wreck it. There we go, you see? There's the LCD screen. And there's the, the glass. See the glass in between this glass and this? It's like a little plastic. Anyway, you can't see it. There it is. That's the glue, but there is plastic in between there, trust me. Right, that came off very easy, didn't it? You know, I don't spend too much time on this, it's a bit dirty here. Because of the glass, watch out for the glass now. That just pulls out, see there? The part there, that just pulled out, because I've disconnected it, see? When you put the new one on, all you do is, I don't know if it come up on the screen, push that into the slot there, and stick it down, which I should be able to show you later on. Anyway. How I'm going to get all this gooey stuff off? It's very simple. Now, a lot of people want to take off the LCD screen. It's easier to work on. But I got told a friend, I said to him, don't tell, take the LCD screen off, you'll drop it. And what happens? He dropped it. All you got to do is melt this, look. Melt this. This stuff melts very easy. 
Now this 